Hi everyone, I'm Holly from Body in Motion, and in this video, I'm demonstrating how you can use a simple tool that you may have at home, an exercise band or an elastic band, to add a layer of difficulty or increased challenge to some very common exercises that you may already be doing. Now, one of my favorite uses of the elastic band is to add an increased stability challenge to exercises. Stability, or a stable base of support, is extremely important for all of our functional activities and athletics. Today we're going to take the plank, which you may think of as a core or abdominal type exercise. We're going to use that band to add an increased stability challenge for the shoulders. If you're having a little bit of a challenge with push-ups or overhead lifts, this technique will help you recruit more of your rotator cuff and your scapular stabilizer muscles in order to be able to perform those activities with more control. So let's get started. So we're going to go into a forearm plank position and you're going to take your band and you're going to put it just below your hands onto your wrists. When you get into your plank position, you want to make sure that your forearms are lined up parallel with your body and that your thumbs are going to be pointing up towards the ceiling. We see a lot of people plank kind of with their arms more like this. Um, that's fine for um, abdominal strengthening, core strengthening, but if we want to get a little bit of more work in for the shoulders, go into this position where we're increasing the challenge on the rotator cuff. We're going to go ahead and get into plank position. I still have my arms um, parallel to the plane of my body. My wrists are the same width as my elbows and shoulders. And I'm just creating some tension in the band as if I'm trying to bring my arms out to the side, but I'm just resisting that tension in the band. From here, really pulling in that tummy, tightening the bottom. And then if I wanted to add a little more challenge, I can lower myself down between my shoulders a little bit and then push my elbows into the floor to lift myself back up. Down and then push my elbows into the floor. So give this a try at home. I'm sure that you will feel that you're getting a lot more engagement in the shoulder and in the scapular or shoulder blade muscles. Have fun.